Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, you guys. Welcome back to Real Talk with SLR. How are you guys doing today? Y'all, it's it's raining. <laughs> sure is. It's a little foggy up there, too. Come back from the beach and head right into the rain. Man, it was, uh, we had a couple of good rainstorms going there and coming back. Oh, yeah. There was very good pockets. To where it was like blinding rain in a sense where it was like buckets upon buckets upon buckets and, and tiny's windshield wipers couldn't go fast enough no <laughs> not really, even close it was working as hard as it could i though. was like all right speed limit's uh, 75 and i'm gonna be doing 60. yeah like <laughs> slowing down to 50 at times <laughs> yeah. like i was definitely i was slowing it down quite a bit yeah. which i'd rather go slower than uh, faster. You oh, know? for sure. I'd rather get here Especially safely. When it was raining like that, and I was like, yeah, I'm not mm. pulling over and stopping and waiting this thing out, but I will slow down a little bit and, mm. you know, go. Had fog lights on and lights on, and just like, yeah. It was a fun time. It was a good time. Mm -hmm. Ryan uh, reminded me a lot of uh, driving in the desert rain. Like, that was exactly like how it was. Yeah, when, like one of those. Um, torrential downpours yes uh, uh monsoons monsoon atmos yeah. atmospheric river <laughs> basically yeah is it what was, it's called it was but. a lot and it was raining so the day that we got home it was raining pretty good that was monday yep. and then yesterday uh we honestly we were just chilling trying to just relax after such a long drive and get the laundry done and kind of like reset the house and stuff mm -hmm. um and it was raining all day yesterday too there was little pockets of sunshine for like an hour uh, but then it's it's just been nonstop. It's just been nonstop. Sometimes it's raining more. Sometimes it's more sprinkling. But it's no. just been it's been nonstop. It's been uh, you know miss. <laughs> I'm happy that you know we were we were able to uh, go have fun and enjoy it. You know Florida and everything. But it was raining pretty good when we left. So it was like. We didn't really miss out on much. Yeah, no. <laughs> it, was raining, it was raining. We went and enjoyed some beach time, and now it's still raining. No, yeah, it's still raining. Yeah, it's just that season here in Arkansas. It's just, this is one of, we have a really good long rainy season, but that's what keeps everything so beautiful and green around here. It's, it's about so. to change, though. Yeah. Honestly, uh, I, every summer, it seems like that's where it's like, it changes from that super rainy season to... Mm -hmm. Let me chill out for a little bit and not rain. But then you're left with the extreme hot humidity. <laughs> Death by sun. <laughs> we, we used to kid about it in the desert where it was like a hair dryer, right? Yeah. Out here, I feel like I, I'm going to say it's a, you know, a hot breath. A hot breath or it's hot just breath. in a spotlight. Or spotlight, yeah. You know, like the sun, it's just, it's very hot. But I'm just saying hot breath because it's like humid yeah. it's that humid heat you yeah, know yeah yeah no, I agree. <laughs> or like walking into the bathroom after somebody took a good shower mm -hmm. you know it's like hot that's hair. a good way it's to look, look at it right there it's kind of yeah. kind of what it reminds me of but but this week that this weekend was such a great time yeah it was such a good good time it was very good i was happy that we got to go spend some time with anthony and rocks and mike and lissa and nope. have some kid free Couples retreat time. It was mm -hmm. pretty, not, pretty awesome. That was that was a that was a blast. I mean, as somebody that has never been to Florida before, that was that was a good time. <laughs> that was a great great time. I could definitely uh, see us doing that. You know, periodically. You know, yeah. throughout. And and maybe next time we'll take the kids. Oh, yeah. The next time we'll definitely <clears throat> take the kids, let them play in the sand and everything else. But we had to go and check it out first. Well, you and, know, and we like, kind of needed it. We need, no, exactly. We needed a retreat for ourselves and, <laughs> you know, but we, I, we like to go and check things out first before we bring the kids, just mainly because it's like, how is it exactly? Yeah. Sometimes you know? we don't, though. Like our cross-country road no. trip, that was all new for all of us. Yeah, but um, we we camped out a lot of times. Mm -hmm. You know, like it wasn't like the the city. Yeah, we stayed out of we stayed out of, of cities. We stayed yeah. in the countryside. Whereas yeah. that we were going to a pretty yeah. well known city. Yeah. You know, so it was like okay, let's go check it out. Let's see how it is. What the vibe is. You know. Yeah. Before we bring the kids and everything else, and we got to enjoy it. You <laughs> know, it's just like you know. When we're watching movies with certain things, it's like, I, I'm not sure if the kids can watch this one or not. Let's watch it first. Yeah, and see how it is. And <laughs> see we, how it if is. If we think they can handle it. Mm -hmm. This week is going to be a good one. It's yeah. uh, 
It's gonna be, I think, raining today, and I think it's supposed to not be raining after today. I think we're just gonna keep playing by ear with the weather, so. Yep. It's gonna be, it's gonna be uh, go, 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 you yeah. know? Per the, the usual, times. per the usual. The times that we can do it. We're really but. trying to get this back decking area uh, zip tied in, connected into the roof, so then we can kind of walk away from it for a little bit and then we can start working on the framing and whatnot for the front mudroom. No. Yep. That's the objective. I'm really happy with where we are, no, because we literally, we just got to finish up this one kicker. Yep. All right. I got to attach my overhangs onto everything, mm -hmm. which that's going to be fun. That's going to be, <laughs> that's the, that is, so the hips itself going in and the overhangs going in at that 45 are the two that I'm like just sitting there in my head like, oh, I think it's going to be all right, but this is going to, this is going to be interesting. I'm not going to lie. This is uh, <laughs> it's one of those things in my brain is like, uh, will it, will it work out? Will it pan out? How am I going to have to chop this end over here? Cause I know I'm going to have to chop something somewhere. You'll just, figure it out. Just, how and where and what. There's been some really good informational emails that have been sent with us by many of our subscribers telling you detailed instructions on how you should go about it if you wanted to read that. I do, I do. It's <laughs> been, we've been nonstop go, go, go. Yeah. So I'll have you pull up some of those and whatnot, be able to go through, look at them. Yeah, there's been Let's several. See. And like, when those things are sent, that's definitely like a Gary email. Mm -hmm. So I tell him, hey, you got an email in here. Yeah. You know, this is definitely for you. And he, he was like, okay, well, I, when I get some time, I'll read it. And we've just been so busy. He hasn't, but we're not ignoring you guys. It's just been nonstop. Go, if, go, go. If it's a, a Gary email that I don't necessarily know how to respond to or what to say, I just kind of like, oh, thanks. And, and I don't really go in through her emails or anything. Just, I mean, I know it's I our emails, right? I tell but, you, hey, there's an email there. No, I know. You. And you're but, like, yeah, I'll go to it. And then he gets busy and s he goes squirrel. Listen, it's a family trait around here. I go squirrel, he goes squirrel, we all go squirrel. Squirrel! It's just, it went. I mean, I'll be happens. in the middle of doing something and then something happens. Yeah. And it's like, well, let me stop what I'm doing right now. For go instance. attend to this for a second, you know? Go and tend with that. And then all of a sudden, it never fails. Once something starts going, right, it all starts going, right? And then it's For just nonstop instance. stopping you in every little direction that you try to go. And it's fixing this, fixing that, fixing this, fixing that. It's like, what the heck? <laughs> For instance, what? <laughs> the well? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, so Friday. Exactly. <laughs> we left on Friday, right? So <coughs> Thursday we were out and we were working on the decking. That was the last day that we got some work in. And um, I took a good fall on Wednesday, right? Something like that. I believe that. That sounds about right. Because we left on it Thursday. It was Wednesday. Because I worked we the did day after. Yeah, and I worked the day after we I fell. Mm -hmm. So that I'm editing out for you guys. I'm just trying to get all of my days straight. See, the squirrel's running the show again. Anyhow, what happened was, we finished work on Thursday. We're getting everything all packed up and stuff, and we're outside, and we're getting everything going. Anthony and Rox are over there hanging out by the well, and they're all, Mal, Gary, Mal, Gary. We're like, eh, hey, well, what's going on with Anthony and Rox? You know, go over there, and uh, they're like, dude, our well is acting really weird. And now the well that we have over here in this main clearing feeds both houses. It feeds uh, Country Road Cure's house. It also feeds our house. Yep. So if there's problems going on with the well, it's gonna affect, it's gonna both, affect of both of us. <laughs> um, now we do have another well that's over by camp that we used and that one um, was we, just essentially for camp life. Yeah. And it's not, a, it's not as, um, I guess, hardy of a well. It's good, it's a good no, well. That's a, it's from what I remember when we got them both done. <laughs> That one's at 120 feet. That one's at 120 feet. They're the same. That one's pump is a 240 pump. That one's a 240 pump. The <clears throat> holding tank's a little bit smaller on that one versus this one because we were using that as the camp life and that is our- That's what it was. You know, our 
camp well, well in a sense. But anyway, that, that's neither here nor there. That well is all the way over there, and it would have taken a lot of piping to bring it over here to it's our building site. It's a great backup site. well. <laughs> yeah, it's a great backup well to fill up totes and uh, for camp, right? When we have people come and stay in their RVs and whatnot or whatever, it's it's nice to have that over there. Um, and it was necess it was a necessity for when we uh, first moved here. I'm beating around the bush. See, this is how I tell stories. <laughs> this is how I tell stories. <laughs> so that well over there um, <clears throat> started like the pump, the, the pressure gauge on it, like as Roxanne was watering her garden, it kept like the hose was like tss, 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 almost like a sprinkler. It and, was short cycling. Yeah, the it pump. wasn't getting enough air in there. So Anthony and Rox are like, Mel and Gary, come over here, come check this out. What do you guys want to do? You know, we're supposed to be leaving like, you know, tomorrow. Yeah. Seriously, it was one of those where I was like, man, what the heck? Yeah. You and know, called up the the well guy, went through the whole all the process tests. that he told us to go through. And it was working for a little bit until we, you know, woke up the next day, went out there and we're like, dang it, it's back to where it was yesterday before we went to sleep. What he had us do is he had us take out our um, our uh, air, con air compressor. And then at the top of the a, tank, we had to open that part up of the the holding tank. And the then bladder was, that was inside of the holding tank. We had to fill tank, that part up with air. Push all the water out, get it to see, see if, see if it, it was leaking out. any air from that thing and see what the pressure was. And yeah, it was, it was interesting. Like we learned a lot more about the well, mm -hmm. you know, but yeah, it ended up coming down to the where the holding tank was messed up something happened inside of the the actual bag yes it allowed water to get past the bag and sit above the bag so it wasn't wasn't building and holding the pressure the way it was supposed to or designed to exactly <laughs> so it was causing you know pressure A lot of issues, issues. <laughs> and we're sitting here and we're we're stressed out because we're supposed to be leaving like the next day and all of the kids are going to be here and get babysat essentially at my house um you know Wyatt yep. and then our three and then plus Serenity all stayed here at my place um they were babysat <clears throat> so we were worried like man the kids are all going to be here and um you know like there's not going to be any water like oh no we can't leave them like this but we ended up um, John ended up coming over and while we were gone we worked with him remotely <laughs> while yep. we were traveling and he ended up completely just exchanging the entire holding tank, the whole thing. He took the old one out, put the new one in. Thank you. Have a nice day. And I was very, very, very happy with how fast he did it and um, with the exchange of it. No, so, I still haven't even <clears throat> went up there and really checked it out. It's been raining so much. It has been. It's all nasty, muddy outside and nasty. Mm -hmm. and I definitely want to go check that out today. Yeah. Go see what's up. No, I do too. I want to get up and get walking around a little bit and enjoy being outside. We pretty much came home and went right into the basement and haven't really... Haven't gotten out. Gotten because outside because it's, it's just been pouring. It's been raining off so. and on. And not only that, I've been tired. Yeah, we've like been no sleeping. Tomorrow. <laughs> well, you, you were champ champion of the drive, man. You drove the whole way there and the whole way back. Yeah, it was Gary's champion for sure. I'm Once I get driving, I drive. Like, I can't. <laughs> I can't help it. It's like, nah, I'm good. I'm just, I'm just cruising. I'm in my mode, you know? Yeah. But it was a good time. It wasn't, uh, it wasn't too bad of a drive at all. And we came through a different part of Arkansas on the way back. Or it could have just been that it was dark and I don't really drive that on that side of Arkansas when it's dark. Yeah. I don't know. Either which way, I was like, what? Huh? Yeah. He? <laughs> Where's that Walmart? That, I he? thought we were going to pass a Walmart. Where? Where? <laughs> yeah, where are we? <laughs> I was so confused. Yeah, we were taking... And it was our first time... <clears throat> Excuse me. We spent a little bit of time in um, in Alabama and then also uh, Mississippi. Mm -hmm. And it was our first time ever being to either one of those states. No. I got to say... Bucky's. I'm not a fan. I know I'm probably going to get a lot of hate for this. At least the one in Alabama. The one in Mobile, Alabama. Forget that mess. Oh, I don't know if it was Mobile, but... Goodness, it was near it. Wherever, the only one. There's only wherever one. Wherever it is, yes. And it's right near Mobile, Alabama. Holy Alabama. crap. Never again, bro. Never again. I don't care how good their stuff is. That is not worth it. 
That is not worth it. We literally, <laughs> we went filled the, up, we filled went. up the gas, went into the bathroom, came out. We we're looking at stuff. And we're like, I don't even want to check out. Yeah. Like there's a line. There was a line like wrapped line. around all of the stuff this inside like, the dude. store to check out. It was like, busier than, than like <laughs> Disneyland or an amusement park. And I'm like, for some snacks. You know, it's one thing if you're getting like a thrill ride out of this, but for some snacks, <laughs> it wasn't worth it. We did use their bathroom and their bathroom was nice. Yeah, um, gas, and they gas had, was pretty decent price. It was it? huge in there. Like there was so much stuff. They did have a lot of like uh, Bucky's made items like with their bakery yep. and they had some jerkies and stuff, but we didn't try any of it because we were like, no, I'm not waiting in a line for an hour to try some freaking jerky. It's not worth it. It's like, like, I, we, we can go somewhere else. And yeah. then we would try to hit up a Burger King. And the, and the, <laughs> the drive in window thing was completely broken. Like you couldn't order. So you had to drive all the way up to the window and then order. And we were yeah. sitting there behind two people. And I was like, man, screw this. I'm going to go inside. Let's go inside real quick. We'll order our stuff and then we can grab and go. Get there. We're standing in line with no recognition like, that nope, we were there at all. In front of us. It's for like just 10 us. minutes. And we're like, Pfft. <laughs> all right fine parties it is it's right there let's go like this is what the heck dude and we didn't then, have the best experience in alabama no but it's beautiful there it was and, beautiful and um but yeah no i don't some of y'all <laughs> probably know exactly what we're talking about when somebody it, knows you know and it's no shade towards alabama it's just that area that of experience. what it was <laughs> right and i was like no so yeah we got gas somewhere else or we got stopped somewhere else got food right and mm -hmm. we dipped out and I drove all the way through Mississippi. Yeah, we were just I like, was like no. I ain't stopping. I ain't stopping Let's in Mississippi. Let's get back home to Arkansas. Let's get to Arkansas. <laughs> <laughs> and one thing I noticed too, like when we were leaving Arkansas and going into Mississippi and um, and then from Mississippi to Alabama, there was no like, welcome, welcome to, to Mississippi. Mississippi Welcome signs. to Alabama. Yeah, there was no welcome signs like going in when we were leaving home and going on our trip. And we were on major freeways and stuff. I just thought that was weird. Like the yeah, maps would odd. tell us like... Google Maps would say it. Welcome to Mississippi. Welcome to Alabama. Mm -hmm. But I would be looking did, around for the sign and I couldn't it find it. It did say it to each state coming home. Yes. Not going to Florida. Yes, but coming home. But coming home it said it. It said which it. Which like, I was like, what? And I saw the sign um, in when we were at that particular spot. And unfortunately, I didn't even get a picture of it. But I saw it with my eyes, so that counts. No. But when we were leaving... Um, and we were getting into, uh, I think it was Florida, getting into Alabama. There's the big sign that says, sweet home Alabama. Mm -hmm. I was like, that's cool. Yeah. And uh, so, yeah, so going home. All yeah, the way going home, home we welcome got all to, Welcome to, but when you're going from Coming Arkansas to down over there, they ain't welcoming at all. <laughs> we were joking about that <laughs> on the it's ride. All day. We're like, man, <laughs> for three years, we've had nothing but Southern hospitality. <laughs> Coming down to Florida, main city area. Oh, nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> We're just messing around. We're just guys. messing around. But it, but it was, it was pretty funny. It was though. interesting. It was something that we noticed. It was comical. Yeah, we were joking about it, but. Anyway. Yeah, squirrel. <sighs> but yeah, see, see, we went squirrel again on just the conversation. And uh, yeah, so we have to go squirrel sometimes on things. And the well, though, thank goodness, is fixed and, and good to go. Yep. And now also, we finally, we've been waiting since October to find out where we're supposed to dig and put our sand filter. And now we finally know where it's going to be. So as soon as, um, we gotta... not to throw anything else on David's plate, because he has so much going on right now, but I need, I know that he needs to check out his backhoe part. Like there's something that needs to be done to it or something. And as soon as he does that, so we're not rushing him, but it, it's literally going to be up to whenever that's ready. Cause I don't want to get out there and shovel life it. No, that's going to be a pit man. So yeah. So when that happens, then we'll be able to get that fixed too. And we'll get rid of our nasty, nasty water that I hate, our water. It was so nice this weekend being able to go into Florida and staying in the, the condo. Like every one of us girls were getting out of the shower like, yes, with our hair. So nice. I, know. I, I don't really. I know. I can't really tell the difference. You can't relate. Really. Your hair's too short. You can't like, tell the difference. 
<laughs> it's okay. Our water out here is so irony and no. um, full of minerals. Like I can feel the difference on my skin. I can feel the difference on my hair. No. I can I can just feel the difference, and I know it's ruining my appliances. So I'm like, oh, I know that for sure. But that's like, man, where let's get the sand as soon as we going. get that sand filter in, I'll be I'll be a happy man because then it's like, all right. I might go ahead and just go buy all new appliances mm. and just say, screw it. Let's put them in. I kind of want to wait. No, I know. But you know what I mean. Yeah. Like, no, I know what you mean. It's. The washer, man. I could, I would want to upgrade. The washer. But like, I. The hot water heater, I don't want to replace it, but I wouldn't mind buying one. So I have a brand new one on hand. Yeah. I I'm hear sorry. That. I take that from your dad. I know. He, uh, <laughs> he was smart with that stuff, man. He actually, I remember the hot water heater blew out on him and he was like, well, give me 30 minutes. Goes Sat over. there and he replaced the whole thing 30 minutes because he had a brand new one sitting in his garage. He's like, I knew it was going to go any minute. I know. Any minute it was going to go. <laughs> See, we need a garage to put stuff like that in. No, I know. I know. And then you can have all those backups to the backups. The backup to the backup. Mm -hmm. To the backup. Well, to the backup. Well, yeah. See, and then it's, we're working on it, guys. Day by day. It. Everything takes time. Everything takes One time. One of these days. One of these days. One of these days. I will have sure. a garage wall full of all the backups. Of like <laughs> the little drawers where it's like, you want, you need something? Yeah, I got it. It's somewhere. It's, it's on this wall. <laughs> <laughs> You'll have it one day, babe. One day. Uh, it's man. I'm not. I'm not gonna know what what to do when I get that garage and I start organizing all my tool stuff and everything because I, I forget half the stuff I even have. Like yeah, it's. Been, <laughs> I know that feeling. It's been sitting in there for three years. It's just like I know that. Oh feeling. wait, that's right. I got I got seven of these. <laughs> yeah. Don't need to get any more of that. I got extra. Anybody need any? <laughs> oh man so i think uh this week we're gonna we're gonna keep getting it on the roofing area that's honestly until that's done that's basically what we're doing no um we do however have to fit in some time where we are unfortunately gonna have to just rock a shovel i know i know it sucks it sucks but at the same time it'll be so nice and it'll be so hopefully it. it's just gonna be auger and post hole diggers. Well, I figure if you and Aunt do the augering, uh, me and Rox can work a shovel. I'm just saying. And there's only six holes that need to be done. No, I know. So, post hole diggers? Yeah. And the uh, um, auger. I can't really work need. a post hole digger. I'm not coordinated enough, but I could work a shovel. I will work the shovel. You're not gonna be able to get it out. That's what I'm trying to explain. Like, okay, well, we're gonna have to do the bigger <laughs> so I can use a shovel. It's either you use your hands or you use the post hole digger. Then I'll use my hands. <laughs> One of the two. I'll use my hands. Cause you ain't pulling a shovel up. <laughs> I'm not super coordinated to use post hole diggers. I know it's like you push inwards and that. Um, no, you pull out to grab. You pull up and then you pull in to let go. That's what I was going to say. Oh, okay. I thought you were, my bad. No, it's okay. I thought you were going the other way with it. But well, yeah. when I'm doing it, it's backwards too. Cause it doesn't like, it's like mirror land. <laughs> no. It's like mirrored to what you think, think you would be doing. Think it's going to be happening. Yeah, yeah, it's mirrored. And so my brain, my um, hand-eye coordination and the way that my brain works, it like I'll always get it in there really good into the dirt, right? And then I'll, I'll do one of them and I could, I mean, I can do it, but it, it's very, it makes my brain hurt <laughs> it may, more, more than my muscles. It's, it's it makes these. my brain hurt. Yeah. Don't do that. I can't do it. No. It's one of those or you got it. <laughs> Your brain is like. Gary can do that, that weird thing really like fast you. too. Can you, you go opposite direction. See if you can do it. Try that at home right now. See how coordinated you one are. One hand goes this way. Yeah. The other hand goes backwards. The other way. The other way. Can you? Can you make it happen? I can't. Man, it's weird. Like, if I if I think about it, my my I mind can't. wants my mind wants to have it go the same I'm way. I'm not coordinated. You can't think man. about it. That's the thing. Yeah. You just you can't think about it. Try that at home. Get a good laugh. Yep. Try it with your partner. If you figure it out, go to your partner and be like, "Can you do this?" You know the trick. The trick <laughs> is literally you cannot think about it. 
You cannot think about Can't it. You only you focus way? on one hand this way? while you're okay. focusing on the other hand. See, I can't even. Am I doing it? Some. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so you had it a little bit. I think you had like one and a half rotations <laughs> until it went. No. <laughs> Let <laughs> me try again. That's your that's forward, your brain for you. Forward. No. Nope. <laughs> forward. I'm right-handed, so obviously I'll be okay with that one. Am I doing it? Uh, ah! <laughs> <laughs> you get like one, and then it's like, nope. It's because of because of my brain. It's it is what it is. I mean. It's yeah. weird. It's I a, can't it's do an it. Odd one. Shame. You guys should Shame. totally try it. It's, Shame. it's weird, and it makes your brain like, "What the heck it is going on?" Feel like it's gonna explode. Yeah. But hey, it's it's a good way to strengthen your brain. Yeah, it and is. Get good hand uh, hand, hand eye coordination. Eye coordination. Yeah. But anyhow, yep. this one's been way longer than we anticipated. We just were <laughs> wanted to come out, and I know that we haven't been posted much because we were on vacay and stuff. Um, today's honestly going to be an editing day for me. I'm going, since it's, it's raining, it's still raining. Well, actually now it's sprinkling, but today's going to be an editing day for me. So I want to try to get a video out from some of the work that we did last week before we left, um, when we were working out on the kickers and, um, get that out for you guys. So I'm going to edit today. Hopefully I'll get that out tomorrow for you guys. I was super ambitious and I was hoping that I would have got it out you know, like yesterday, but that was assuming that I was going to edit yesterday morning and then post the same day. And I ended up just napping like crazy yesterday. And um, I'm not going to post today when it's finished editing only because we are going live tonight. Correct. And so, yeah, so there's but that. <laughs> it's going to be a good day. It's going to be a really, really good day. Yeah, no, I'm, um, I'm excited for today because today's going to be another very good step in the right direction. Mm -hmm. Getting all the things ready. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. So, anyway, love you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. We'll be back with another episode of Real Talk with SLR tomorrow. Um, we'll see you guys live tonight at 7. Simple Life Claimed. And until then. Yeah, we love y'all. Hope you have a good one. And we'll catch you on the next one. Bye, you guys. Later, later. Try it. Try it. <laughs> Try it. <laughs>